of Hester. It be too late to alter course, mateys. <laughs> come back and look at this again tonight when it's dark because there's lights all in this but uh, this is a new limits rock formation that Lee from bone box did <laughs> Paul and Shane. Oh, man. this has actually been Lee's build right here I don't know what he calls this truck, but it's like the toxic waste dump. Shockwave. Shockwave, he calls it. All right. <laughs> oh, man, that's awesome. And then, I don't know if you guys have seen this yet. It's a build uh, by Dave. Oh, the new one? Also known as uh, Sloth Crawler on Instagram. Uh, from RC Crawler Addicts. Actually, here we go. There's one of their crawlers and coffee banners right here. RC Crawler Addicts. That's. If you've seen our other videos, you probably remember this trailer from uh, Axial Fest. So, when I follow it, I'll buy this. A couple of the Bone Box guys' trucks right here. I know, I like want to drive it. This is Xavier, but more RCs. I'm going to try to keep it for tomorrow. Interceptor, Capper Bill. And we did a video on this truck uh, just a few weeks ago. This is a base camp, all rock parts equipped on uh, Interceptor rails. Let's check out the paint job on this. The lighting's better here, so you can see it better. This is the senior rock pirates truck. All tricked out with uh, pro line, fully pro line equipped. Tires, rims, the body, and then it's got the interceptor chassis underneath it. Rock pirates, rock sliders, the hardline bed. So rock pirates base camp. You guys have probably seen this in our other videos. You've seen this. And this truck here was built by Kelly Crawler. And uh, actually, hey Kelly. Kelly, come tell me about this truck. I mean, check out this custom build, everybody. This thing's insane. So I'll let I'll let Kelly pick it up and go go through what he did to this thing because this yeah. is probably one of those rad builds we've seen in a while. And of course, we're you know we're a little bit biased. It is a rock pirates truck, but it's worth uh, it's worth the attention. So I'll let Sergio talk about it. I wanted to do a collabo when it came to this rig. I wanted to, everybody to kind of showcase the stuff that they put out there. So we got the spec wheels and 
um, Skill Metal Supplies made the bumpers and stuff like that, and, and just all the great products that you guys put out from the rock sliders and the battery tray and the shock towers and stuff. And as always, I'm a little old school, so when I do something, I have to go a little overboard, you know what I mean? So we ended up copper plating pretty much the whole chassis on the thing, copper, pl copper plating everything, went with stainless steel hardware, and just wanted to wanted something a little different, a little bling bling, I guess you can say, but. You know, um, everything I put out there, I try to put my heart and soul into it and just, uh, you know, kick it up a notch. Make it a little different. I'm glad you guys like it, though. That thing's beautiful, man. Thanks. Appreciate Thanks. it so much. Awesome. And this is no quarter. You don't have any copper plated body parts in the How's it going, bud? Good to see you, bud. So the next thing we're going to go over, it's even crazier. Check this out. So I don't know if Lee's still here. I gotta get Lee over here. Hey, where's Lee? Uh, Lee is still here? Yeah, Lee built this. This is Bone Box again. Lee Lewis on Instagram. But uh, check out this treasure chest. Built into this rock formation, he did. He's got rock pirates, gold, gold shock towers in here, jewels. Yeah, look at this giant shock tower. This thing is about the size of your hand is bigger than that even. But uh, this is all lights up at night. We'll cover it again later tonight. Oh, uh, yeah. We got the 24 scale. It doesn't have a motor in it, so. Rock by ships on here. Oh, yeah, the one. Starting to build an armada over here. Be sick. Now, this truck here. This is West Desert Wheeler, Logan, from Utah. Really? Yeah, and uh, we've got a lot of the guys from Utah here with us, but Logan didn't make it. But uh, they stole his truck, brought it here before they left. And uh, so here at the Rock Pirates booth, we got uh, West Desert Wheeler's truck out here on display. So we're stoked about that. Yeah, And um, so, so many custom builds I got this year, it's just crazy. Yeah. This is the Black Pearl. I don't know if you guys can see in the paint. But this thing has ghost, ghost skulls in it and stuff. It's in a matte black skull on the hood. Carbon fiber side Those, panels yeah, on it. Stainless. Stainless steel. And then there's the yeah. wild. And this is Lee from Bonebox, another one of his yeah, builds. Yeah, I mean, you got the, like a TIG welder. Check out this pirate rig. Weld on stainless, you can, yeah. And every time the Bonebox guys come out, Lee, they just blow us away with this cool stuff. They're always, the creativity they put into them is amazing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wild. And of course we got product out here for sale, Interceptor chassis, Luck Pirates t-shirts, Luck Pirates hats. Oh, D's companies out here with us, hanging out with us. We got the, these D's bands out here. And a bunch of Rock Pirate uh, hardline beds. And this is a uh, Rock Pirates Interceptor, stainless steel chassis. And this is the builder's kit uh, from Element. Just switched into the Rock Pirates rails and then Rock Pirates bed and sliders on it. So, check this out. So, product laid out here, make it simple for people. And then we got a surprise for everybody. Rock Pirates is now. Yeah, so they. Starting to make parts for the SCX6. And there's the new side panel. Those on the trekking bed. Those are now available at Rock Pirates RC. And they're available not only in silver, but we also have them in black. We'll come back for our booth later tonight when it's a little bit darker and uh, yeah. all the light and everything in here is super cool.
you win. This is no joke, guys. You win. <laughs> this is just happening. This is happening. This guy just rolled up. Look, look at this. The Jack Daniels truck just pulled up. <laughs> hey, I ain't gonna be shy. Yeah, grab that one. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to kick in some uh, bartender uh, uh, tips here. How many pouring? Who else? This one. This one's mine. This one's mine. It's cold. Is it cold? Yeah. Is it really? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's not selling, so don't arrest this guy. He's just out here having having fun at an event. They checked their IDs already. <laughs> <laughs> that is sick, dude. That is sick. <laughs> oh, that's the greatest thing all day. Brought, well, brought something for you. Uh oh. Can I have one? Ah. <laughs> oh. Yeah, the body's just sitting on there, so. Wow. Hey. Look. Hey, I made a look. Oh, shit. You don't check it. That's awesome. Hey, look at all the branch here, bro. Oh my god, guys. So, somebody can mount the magnets to the body if they want. The yeah. paint is a little fresh. <coughs> I've been over there the last couple hours yeah. painting oh. and finishing that body, so. Um, that is awesome. So, we're gonna raffle it up. Well, we're gonna raffle it up tomorrow then. So, with that, yeah. you guys actually have. It's got a spectrum receiver. Okay. You got a spectrum remote okay. with a lanyard. To go with it, you have all of the spare parts as far as they came with the builder's kit. And then we had our crawlers and coffee event last weekend, and we started off a little bit to try and get you guys jump started. I mean, there's everybody put a phone number on a ticket, so if you do draw them, so you've got. Uh, 20 bucks in there yes. from our little event last weekend yes. and uh, the help get you kick started for raffling that off. Perfect, bro. We cannot thank you guys enough, man. You know, we're going to raffle it off then do it tomorrow. Okay. So you guys are here. Oh, absolutely. Present with me so we can talk about this. Actually, tonight I want to show it up so you know, people will see. This is what we got yeah. tomorrow. No, absolutely. Yeah. Man. Yeah. Beautiful. Man. Thank you, bro. Thank you so much. I want that. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, brother, rock cards, thank you guys. Oh, man. Thank you guys. Awesome. This is the man that put it all together. We just played the part. So. Thank you, bro. I'm the crawler addict. I'll the whole thing. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hey, can you guys go in the booth? Please take a photo. Yeah, yes, yeah, sounds good. Thank you. And uh, thank you, Jeff. Thank you. 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 Thank yeah, one of a kind. Yes. 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 I do need him. I need to program the ESC. Oh, yeah. A bunch of tickets. <laughs> I know I'm like, I'm not good. I gotta have him program the ESC. Okay, okay, that's cool. We'll do that later today. Yeah, yeah. That's what and we'll still got tomorrow because it's gonna be at the end of the day to raffle. That way they can kind of do. This is oh my god. That is awesome, man. That is awesome.
Too good on there. That's the only car I got on display all weekend. Was that one. <laughs> Yours is sitting in the Honda. Nobody yeah. wanted it. RC drag car. That's it. Right Little drag car. That's all we got. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Who we got here today? All right. How's it going? I'm Ryan with Shipped RCs. Um, out here at ProLine by the Fire. <clears throat> Come by and check out any of the new products we have. Um, we released our pit mats here today uh, awesome. with our green wheels, our Vision Vision 2.2 wheels. Yeah, I just picked the two sets of these today, everybody. I got the 2.0s. Are they 2.0 or 2.2? My brain just went frozen. Uh, 2.2 and 1.9. And the 1.9s are right there. Okay, there we go. Awesome, awesome. And then, uh, yeah, it's our little low rider. That has the XBs in it. It's our custom one. If you look down the mirror, you'll see the. Pretty trick. It's all chromed out in there. Even that differential, everything. <laughs> That's sweet. And then most people know the servo lineup. You know, you have your winches, uh, S2.0, your budget servo, the monster. GT3, direct power. This will be our racing servo. Um, we'll see that in the race cars. And then our cool. micro. Nice, check that out. And then this is the mat. I love the laser work on these servos, it's amazing. That's actually the mat right there. I don't know if we can see that. Oh yeah, it's showing through. There yeah, it's go. all laser etched. Oh, that's sick. Heck yeah, check out this monster right here. SCX6, complete custom build. Yeah, tube chassis. Right. Uh, Proline uh, Swampers on it. it. Has crazy crawler foams. Heck Stock yeah. electronics, except the servo obviously has our X5. Nice. All right, cool. Thanks hey, a lot, thank Ryan. You. Appreciate it. Thank you. Appreciate it. I can't do a hybrid. Low yeah, race. That's all you do for softball. I got this. Okay, everybody, we just crashed uh, my trick RC. We're here with uh, Dan. He's just sitting up his booth, so I apologize to Dan because I interrupted him setting this up. But hey, guys, here's the man right here. Yeah, this is it. This is our 10 year anniversary. And so we went all out. We go out all out every year, actually. But yeah, uh, yeah so this is our castle. We take it everywhere. Uh, it barely fits in our trailer, but uh, we it made it out here. And uh, we've been working on this probably for the last month or so. It was a big engineering project to figure out how to just do everything. Yeah. Make all the props inside. But the real magic is going to happen tonight when everything is all lit up, and uh, yeah. that's when this whole place is just going to like come alive. So like we said, he's just setting this up, and so we'll come back tonight when this thing is all decked out. So, but uh, apologize to Dan uh, hitting him like this. But if you guys haven't noticed, Dan is probably he's probably six one, six two, I, I guess, just down in here. Yeah, this is and, uh Six three. Six three, and the castle is just a hair taller than him. <laughs> This is sick. I had to make it epic. Oh, for that sure. That's my measuring yard. Yeah, so, and it goes inside, but we'll come back tonight when he finishes up. So, all right. Killer, Dan. Thank you, sir. Come on. Appreciate it. My trick RC, everybody. My trick RC. Crazy. I've got no more space in my. So, how do you build it? Uh, it's all floating for it, mostly. Uh, so, I have a custom graphic for that rig. Yeah, I can see it. Yeah. You guys, you need to hold those or what's that? <laughs> Things are 3D printed like 
got I got these at news, so I know where that tail is. Okay, I love it. Can you do that? You guys can't hear in Texas. Good afternoon, gentlemen. Came out from Texas. All right. All right. Well, I'm glad you're here. Okay, here we go. We are at Element, everybody, and uh, we got Mr. Schultz himself here to talk about a new product that just was released here. What? Huh? No. Uh, this is our new. Element, Bushido. You make the decision what it looks like. Very nice. Samurai. I said them, not you. Oh no, I wasn't gonna say anything. Uh, comes with a lemonade wool base. Uh, comes with a circle in the back, so you can add it or take it away. It also has two different graphics for the sides. Uh, comes with our general grabber tires. Um, it has light buckets, so you can put actual lights in it if you want to. Um, there's the other graphics right there. There we go. I live at home for a couple of us yeah. have our personal ones where we put inner fenders and we painted the bed black, which I think looks really, really good. But this is our new latest and greatest. It goes for $3.99. $3.99, dude. Yep. So that's an RTR later on, $3.99. RTR. And you can also get in a combo kit for another 50 bucks. Nice. So uh, if you guys right. need it, you know why it's hot. Uh, I'll start ordering it now. Very cool. Next couple weeks. You guys tell me what John said, but what was the wheelbase on it? Uh, 11 8. 11 8. 11 8. So check that out, everybody. It gives you a lot more options for not only this truck because it sits right now, but down the road when you want to do upgrades. Uh, you know, tons of things you can do with yep. that wheelbase. Or if you were looking to take your old element and make it a short wheelbase, there's a lot for it. Right, absolutely. Everybody seems to keep making ones longer. We may wish you out. Very cool, bud. And what is bounced down the row here? All the new custom garages that they have. The green Ecto. That's another big thing. Every box, every kit comes with its own garage. This is what the Ecto, green Ecto comes with. We just released it. This is uh, the new truck's garage. I got the Night Runner, and you, you and start looking in the boxes because there's a lot of little hidden figures and little things. So it's got 10 millimeter bo uh, sockets in there. We got Night Runner. What's going on there? Trail Runner. Got a Trail Runner. Like a, like a dealership. This is a, one of our, our custom uh, build trucks with uh, extras on it, and we have our HD. Now this is, the truck's been out for probably, what, a couple years now, a year and a half? Uh, it's been out for about a year, yeah, a year or so. And I'm just going to tell you guys, this is still one of my favorite right trucks right here. Yeah, mine too. Yeah. Yeah. I like this truck, and uh, there's so many aftermarket parts for it, you can just do great things. You guys have so much fun with it, I love that truck. Yeah, yeah. A few custom things over here, and uh, I'm gonna run around here real quick because I gotta get Dave my build projects. Yep. Whoop. Check out this custom build right here, guys. One of our favorite trucks, blue anodized rock pirates bed. Sliders, shock towers. She's our keeper. Yes. He's awesome. All right, thanks everybody. We're at the Proline booth. You guys can see the stained glass here. The Proline bottle fire. Yeah, it's nice that they're looking up. Hey everybody. What's up? Going great. Thanks for another awesome event. Appreciate it. Absolutely. Going to cruise through here and see what we got going on. Horizon Hobbies booth, all the way down, products all across the table. That's a lie. Hey, there's the reef. Hey, he's in the wrong booth. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Okay, here we are with Radio Control Car Action again this year at Proline by the Fire 2022. Lee's with us again. What's up? How's everybody doing? 
We got some uh, good stuff to show you real quick. You got uh, Monster Fabs, um, tube chassis sand dry cars. Moving down, he's got a slash replacement chassis. Pretty cool. Nice and hot sitting in the sun. Probably my favorite thing here. You'll recognize these little heads. There it is. Right there. Look at this guy here. That's sick. This is uh, Mark from Headhunters. Check him out for sure. We got Dan's Mallory who made this. This is for uh, for the Halloween season coming up. Yeah, that's cool. Brought candy and wandering over here. I think we have something of yours over here, don't we? Oh, check this is out. This, uh, is this yours? Is this uh, RC Patina doing what RC yeah, Patina looks, does? Looks like Eric took a, a Rock Pirates build. And a little gremlin dude. And he made it definitely... Uh, it's got a mixture of different parts on it, but it's definitely got a Rock Pirates... Uh, let me swing around the back here. It's definitely got the Rock Pirates hardline bed on it. Rear shock towers. But uh, even the inside of this truck, the interior is pretty wild. So that's awesome. Yeah, and this is all his stuff over here. He took the FMS stuff. I, I sent him the trucks and I said, do something cool. And of course, he, he lost his mind and did these. And uh, <laughs> this is a uh, SCX24 catapult yeah, with the wood. He was throwing M&Ms at people. His dead ball. Oh, heck yeah. That's awesome. And then we got Yvonne. Say hello to Yvonne. Bring hey, in Yvonne. refreshments. Hi. Everybody's favorite person, the one that has food and drinks. <laughs> yep. And in charge of payroll. <laughs> that always helps too. Look at this, it even has dragon scales all down the side of it. It right did, here. and they're soft too. They're not even, they're not <laughs> even wow. like fake. No. Yeah, so we did a quick backdrop, but uh, yeah, look at this backdrop. So yeah, yeah. carry all in the bags, like, everything yeah. is pretty much, uh, that's pretty much it. We got. We got my 50 pound SCX6 over here, which I tired of carrying around, and uh, that's it. Having a blast. All right, cool. Yeah. Thanks, Lee. Appreciate Take it. Take care. Man. How are you? Okay, so we're out here at Proline by the Fire. Just ran into these two characters, but uh, look at these custom rock fire builds. They got here. That's an interceptor chassis on that one. Is this, is this trick on the name out? This is just the Rock Pirates truck, that's it. <laughs> no name, sorry, I'm not on this Okay, one. and then we got Derek right here. And uh, Derek's got, this is a dead boat, obviously. And uh, they're heading out to the rocks right now to get ready to crawl them. But, uh, there we go, it's all good. With the Flying Dutchman heading out to the rocks right now. So, all right, guys. Hey, thanks right, a lot. Thanks, Steve. All right, thanks. Okay, we're over here at El Cajon Hobbies. We're gonna drop in here real quick, see what they've got going on. How's it going guys? Ryan here from El Cajon Hobbies. Uh, we're based out of San Diego, California. Um, kind of down by Chula Vista, almost closer to Mexico. Um, we do mostly bashers and stuff. A lot of crawlers, bashers. Number one low seat dealer on the West Coast um, out here at Crawling by the Fire. It's a great event. My third year here and first year as a store. So look forward to all the events and appreciate Rock Pirates for the exposure and you guys being out here. Thank you, buddy. So, Appreciate yeah, it. No problem, man. So it's uh, man, it's got buddies out here. So obviously these guys were in the crawling, so they're well supplied. If you guys need parts for your rock crawlers, here we go over here. Horizon products, Proline shocks, two stage foams from Proline, Proline tires, Proline rims. And of course, all kinds of rock crawler kids. So go the check them out, guys, if you're in their area, down in El, El Cajon, California. And uh, thanks again, guys. Appreciate it. All right. Thanks, man. In case you guys don't know, this is my sister right here. So this is my dad. And uh, he doesn't do a lot of RCing, but this is the fresh build that he just put together. Named Parlay. Parlay, there we go, there we go.
That's great. Oh, oh, it's half on, half on. Yeah, it still works. Oh, this is just, this is like, just, this is just like taking the F-350 through, uh, through in and out. Yeah, that's all you gotta do. Ask, ask for a double-double. Tell me you want grilled onions. You know, what, just go animal style because, you know, you're out, you are out rock crawling, so you might as well just go animal style. Look at your tires. Oh, oh no, that's not it. <laughs> <laughs> you two made way too many weights on it. Hey, there have too many rocks on this thing. What's going on here? Oh, wait. Hey, there it goes, there it goes. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. Hey, there we go. Way to go. Let's try it again. <laughs>
once again for joining us here at By the Fire 2022. Who here is ready to test thy might? Yeah. Who here is ready to prove your fortitude? Yeah. And who here is ready to test your courage and sanity at the wall of death? That was paltry and pathetic at best. Let's try that again. Who here is ready to test your courage and sanity at the wall of death? That's better. May your tribulations be few. May your testing be triumphant. Go forth and have a glorious time. Thank you!
Sweet, thanks, Paul. All right, buddy. Okay, so the horse is going back. Also, one of the. I think the flags are the night before. I wasn't going to do that all day. I was like, I can do that. I don't think it's a bad thing. Oh my god. Let's sell this up for you know? All right, go ahead and get on the line. So I just had to swap the other axle in. All right, let's see what the feeling goes, man. Four hours, so everyone else was tired. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
Jim Riggs. Jim Riggs. Riggs Family right? RC. All right. Yeah, yeah. On you. All right, ready? Three, two, one, go. Ooh. Whoa! Good job. You guys know you guys want this? You guys want this. Oh yeah, check that out. Starting with the kids class, the winner was Chevelle Keats. Let's hear it for Chevelle Keats. Come on up and get your award. Alright, Chevelle, let's hear it for her. Can we get a shift RC up here? Where are these guys at? Where are you? Come on up, come on. I think they've got something extra for all the winners of the, the concourse here. One thing that is an extra for the kids class, not just a trophy, but an SEX 24. And what else is everyone in the concourse, the winners getting? What are they getting? So, on behalf of Shift RC Elite Comps and uh, Vizio and everybody in, in uh, SoCal here, all the groups, we're going to donate $100 per winner. So, they're going to get asked for that. And that was all Shift RC's idea, just to let you guys know. Thank you, Shift RC. Go over here for your picture. $100 right yeah. there. $100 cash. And the form of cash in your SCX24. Where did it go? Right here. She wants to give it to a kid who does not have a car. We want to hear the loudest kid scream. You're going to win this. Thompson, Mike Thompson, you won the concourse for the monster class. Oh, here he is with his rig. All right, the winner of the trailer class was Hector Garcia. Hector Garcia. Winner of the trailer class. All the winners back there. Let's hear it for Hector Garcia. There's his rig right there. All right, the winner of the military class was Carter Warren. Carter Warren, you won the military class. Carter, come on up. And the Proline fan went to Thunder Wessels. Thunder. Thunder Wessels. All right. The winner of the medieval class was Brian Schuster. Come on up, Brian. The Rust Bucket class went to Jesse Marshall. Jesse Marshall, come on up. And the overall winner was Mark Fernandez. Come on up, Mark.
Let's hear it for all of our winners of the concourse. got the, the joust event winners. wins this battle. Gets an exclusive special patch. Just oh, for this. Let's hear Who's Lionheart? Who's Lionheart? Seconds left in him. All right, final push. Let's hear it for him. Let's hear it. Give me two. Oh, you're done. Nice. It wasn't luck. Nice. It wasn't luck. Nice oh, boy, baby. Right nice. Thank you. First time. Yeah. Oh, Want to get the cross ship in there? Yeah. Yeah. Come on, Moses. Can I have one of those? It's not even a full draft. It's not even a full draft. You're on the axle. Okay. Oh, 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 that's a really good There we go. Oh. Brian's getting crazy. He's going to catch it for him. I can't reach that. He needs to stand up. He needs to stand up here. 
I'm filming, I'd be there, but I'm filming right now. Son of a damn. We gotta get this on film. Oh, baby. Yeah. Nice. Oh, it's looking good right now. I'm not to the back tire yet, I'm scared. What's the back tire yet? Yeah, I'm scared. There's that tire right there that's got a hit. Bring it I think bring the back tire will grab right there. You got the hook on the top. It was good this time, Brian. I wish you had a brush. <laughs> it, it Sorry about the moment. hands in the video, yeah. everybody. But... Oh! Hey! Hey! Woo! 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 That's a big drop, it's bud. It's a cliff down oh. there, guys. That's oh, why you saw hands down there. <laughs> 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 I almost think it's better to drive it from down there. It, I just, that like, whole time when you said the tire's hooked, I could not see that. Yeah, up here you have that nub, like, perfect. <laughs> There it goes. Popped up. Oh, yeah. You see the speed line. Climb up there. Yeah, you guys go this way. Now, like, too far up. You need to start cutting. The ass is coming around, so that's kind of nice. Hard up on the skid now. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Oh, man. I don't like this job. <laughs> <laughs> this truck's like on its slide right now. Yeah. yeah. I'm not. I'm not tilting the camera. That's, those wheels are sick. Those wheels are bad. Oh, I'm just not touching it. There is a safety nut in case it goes, wants to go off the cliff, and I don't like it. Yeah. too low. Oh, he slides. Oh, I see him. Put him back over. It let go of that, that, this one, when it was about to go, it was on that on the inside edge, and it popped out. So maybe keep an eye on that when you go through. Turn right a little bit. Keep it straight. Straight, straight, and then turn right. See the tires oh. held. Tires held. That's it. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> nice. You can throw up a battle float cross. Yeah. I can get, get up to it. And we're done. As far as you went up, or slow crawling, you were staying quiet. You can see the dispatcher is going up all the way up. That's good. So over that forward end. Dude, that truck is just vertical. Oh, and it's slow yeah. crawling it. Next a little to the right. You see this spot now, right, buddy? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'll shut up there.
Nice one! Woo! Purdy to be on an obstacle this tough. I kind of want to go catch him. You're only two. They're on your tires. Look at those things. Just get this up. Oh, oh my goodness. Christ. Work it, girl. And no quarter getting it. I'm not feeling the obstacle yet, there, bud. Ah, oh, man. Right. 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 I think this truck is right. understanding the assignment. <laughs> Straight. First time. 